Hello, this is Kevin King with Pinehurst Websites, and today I'm going to show you how to create a product with multiple variations. In other words, maybe it has multiple sizes or multiple colors that the product comes in. So uh, this is a new website which uh, we just created. Now we're going to go to the administrative side of the website, and on the left-hand side you've got all of your uh, controls here. Let's go to Product, and let's go to Add a Product. And uh, I've already copied some information that we're going to use. And it's going to be, here's the title of the product I'm going to put in. So I'm just going to copy that over to make things a little quicker here for this demonstration. And then uh, we're going to go into put in a description. Copy that over as well. And paste that right in here. Okay, so now let's go ahead and create a new type. And the type is going to be shirt. And then over here, we're going to create a new vendor. Johnny. Oh, okay. We're going to put in a price. And we're going to put in a weight. Uh, your items won't charge shipping if there is no weight in there, so uh, unless you have a flat shipping fee. Uh, but if you do it by weight, it won't charge it. Now we want to track inventory on all your product variants, and uh, what we want to do is we want to use this little checkbox right here is going to create all your variants here. So let's go ahead and let's create a variant that's called style because this particular item is going to come in a couple different patterns. So right here are the names of our patterns. Just going to copy it over. And we have you can type this in as well. Okay, so we have three different styles, and then we're going to add another variation, which is going to be size. And it's going to come in small, medium, large, extra large, and extra, extra large. Okay, so now we've created all our different variations. Uh, let's go ahead and put a main image in for this. And we've got that in there. Uh, now, once we save it, we're going to see all our variations come in here. Now, if we scroll down, look at all our variations right here. So. We can put an image in for each variation, so when people click on that variation, that image will come up. So uh, all of these right here are going to have the same image. So this makes it very quick. We can just go ahead and update the image for this. And that's going to be, let's make sure I have the right image, Captain Fun. Click that and save it. Now they all have that image. So we need a new image for this one, so let's go ahead and add an image. Captain Hook. So all of these, we want to have the Captain Hook image right here. This just makes it very quick for adding all your variations. And then it automatically fills that for you. And then we have one last one that we want to add an image for. And that is going to be this one right here. And we can do that all at once.
so it does all that work of creating each variation for you just with the drop down so very quick to create we've created a number of different variations one two three four five six times three we've created 18 different products and it only took us a couple minutes to do the other thing we like to do is just put in the alternate text and this helps your SEO right here so just copy the title is a good one to copy in there you can also put the Captain Hook or Captain Jack as well would be good for but I'm just doing this to show you how quick it is to create all your different variations so now you're done you can create a collection for this and add this into a collection let's go ahead and take a look at it and see what it looks like on the website and there we have it so we've got our different variations as you click on each one it changes out the picture for you and you can choose your size right here is your drop down and right here is your drop down if you just want to choose your choose your item right here Thanks for tuning in. This is Kevin King from Pinehurst Websites. If you want to learn more about Shopify, check out my tutorials at pinehurstwebsites.com. If you need help with the site, please feel free to contact me and uh, we can get your site up and running. Thanks for tuning in.